So every time you frame something and then learning one, oh, I got this. Learning to, no, I didn't get it right. I have to redo it. Learning to, and then learning three in the process of doing this. Wow, I am transformed. So it's this sense of being renewed, of being changed, of being in wonder and enchantment of the opportunity, of the miracle of being alive. And that's why I understand when you use the word sacred more than wisdom. It's just like, wow. And that's why I have these four uh, ground rules when we start the journey of the Wisdom Project. The first one is presence, because we are going to notice, as you said, that we are wiser than we thought. And that's why I start the sessions with King Solomon, the very famous uh, king of the Bible who wrote proverbs and books and, and people traveled to see him. But he was very, very foolish too. He had too many women in his life. He went bankrupt a few times. He like loved gambling and drinking. So he was a, not a perfect uh, wise person. So I like to start the journey of the Wisdom Project with him as a role model that we, imperfect as we are, we can also have wisdom. And as you said, there is a repository of uh, wisdom in all of us. But that's being present with that wisdom and imperfection that is in ourselves, like it was in King Solomon. But then the other one, as you mentioned, is the courage to keep going. And when we don't have the courage because we get frustrated, because we get anxious, because we tried to do it and we didn't succeed, then the other two ground rules is please be kind to yourself. Because you are doing it. You are trying to transform your life, yourself, your community, your workplace, your family. So please be kind. Treat yourself well. And if it just so happens that you cannot be kind or you cannot be courage, co courageous or you cannot be present, at least be compassionate. Be, have compassion for your human condition. So I keep repeating these are the ground rules of the journey towards wisdom. Be present, be courageous, be kind and be compassionate. In the pro, <clears throat> as you said, the process has, as people don't like when we use this word, some people, but there is this sense of sacredness, of the sacredness of being alive and being in community. 